ladies and gentlemen, today I'm going to go over a brief tutorial on how to get Minecraft, specifically modded Minecraft, to broadcast on Discord. Now I am display recording right now so you can see my Minecraft and you can also see my Discord. Um, so now you see right now, if you're able to broadcast a game on Discord, you'll see a little thing that looks like a little TV like thing above your user settings. Let's go ahead and maximize this. It should be up in this area right here, but it's not. When you play modern Minecraft, it's not there. Um, Discord does not notice the game you're playing. So let's go to user settings and let's go to game activity. Now it says no game detected and stuff like that, right? Uh, so let's scroll down here and make sure we don't see a Minecraft anywhere, which we do not see a Minecraft. All right, let's scroll back up. All right, so I'm going to add the game. Now, you don't even need to type anything right now. What this is going to do is give you a list of all the open programs that you're, that Discord's able to record from. So if you see right there, I have Minecraft 1.12.2. So I just click that and hit add game. Um, I also like to go ahead and turn on the overlay you're pretty much set, good to go. Now, if you exit out, you can see it right there, Minecraft 1.12.2. Um, you click go live, and it's gonna tell you your stream starting, blah, 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 live recording, go live. So now it's gonna show me a little thing right here. You can, um, people can pop this out. You can invite people, all that kind of good stuff. Now, if you know this, if I can, if that, it doesn't stay up, let's double click this and make this smaller and get all this stuff out of the way. All right, so let's pull Discord back up so you can see both of them. And see right here, this is the basically what's being broadcasted to everybody. Um, you have to be in a uh, Discord server and in a, uh, a voice channel to be able to do this. So if I go back to Minecraft and I move it around, let's see what it says here. Okay, so let's move this back over. There we go. All right. So if I move around, click back here, you see it moves. Okay, let's go outside. Make sure it's updating. And I'll look up at the sun. You should be able to see. Okay, you see how it updated? So everybody can see that completely live from Minecraft to Discord. So that fixes that issue. Just add the game, like I said. Um, another issue is when you're done recording, all right, stop streaming. And let's say you close the game for some reason. Okay, I'm gonna close the game and I'm gonna relaunch the game and we'll be right back. Okay guys, we are back. We have the pack loaded up. And here's the game. And here's Discord. And you see our setting again is not there. So this you will have to do this every single time that you load Minecraft. You will have to go back into user settings, go back into game activity, and you'll have to add the game. Click the down arrow. Now there's a problem. There's no Minecraft there anymore. And you can't type it in because it searches the available um, open apps and programs that your computer has open. Uh, so the thing is, you see right here, the added games, last played 13 minutes ago. Um, this is a problem. It's already on the added games, but it's not picking it up for, for some reason. So we're going to go here and we're going to close it out. And then we're going to go back to add it and hit the down arrow. And there it is again. So we click it, add a game, turn our overlay on, escape out. And now our go live is back. Click go live, double click that, go down. Did it pop up? It didn't pop up. Okay, the overlay just popped up. Let's hit go live again. There it goes. Go live. Go live. And there we go. Multiplayer. And there, done. You can see it's loading in. We'll watch it as it as it goes. There we go. Logging in. Good to go. So pretty much each time you want to do it. Each time you load the game and stuff, you have to go in there. If this is not here, you have to go in, remove it, and then add it back. As simple as that. 
Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Um, I also have the how-to shaders for uh, Dungeons and & Dragons and Spatials. Also, check out this series. It's pretty cool. Uh, my other series and stuff. And leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you'd like to. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for stopping by. Hey, guys. Thanks for checking out my video. Click the K in the middle to subscribe to my channel. Click the left link to see one of my current playlists. Or click the right link to view the next or previous video in this series.